Hello, it's been a while. How is everyone? I know my hair looks like shit. I don't care. Well, I love the color, but it just doesn't look like it's not, it's not pretty. <laughs> so, I haven't washed it in a few days. I'm trying to let the oil build up in it again. So, but this, <clears throat> right here, this is what we're doing tonight. I know it's instant ramen, but we're going to fuck around with it a bit because, you know, I can. So, you know, why not? Um, this, this stuff is pretty spicy. We had it the other night. Um, I had it the way I used to do it. Where I just nuke it in a bowl with like just enough water kind of thing. Get it really creamy and delicious and blah, blah, blah. <clears throat> and that was amazing. Then we tried it. Um, I did it for the uh, package instructions. And I did not like the amount of, I didn't like the flavor of it. It involved a good bit more water. And I didn't really care for that because it really diluted everything. So tonight, I'm going to do two packs once again, and we are going to cut the water essentially in half. So, it's <clears throat> a little bit too much. This will work. So, uh, let's, okay. <clears throat> in this little um pan earlier what i did was i charred i sauteed and charred some onions this is these right here you can see like the really strong black bits in there like i literally intended i intended i intended to do that because i wanted to get as much of the smokiness into it as i can to try to recreate that you know cooked for hours kind of flavor. And honestly, burning shit's the best way to do it. You don't do a lot of burn. I put it in there for about, it was about eight minutes, kept stirring them. And then I put it on a medium high and set it, pushed them all down, let it sit for like four minutes, came back, a couple of them were just starting to blacken, pulled it all off in. So, that's how you do it. <clears throat> this, I have me some chicken thighs that I'm going to fry up. They have been marinating in uh, cilantro, garlic, a little bit of rice wine vinegar, and fish sauce. To get as much flavor as I possibly can in them. I'm gonna cook them off in the exact same pot or pan that I cooked the mushrooms in, my mushrooms, onions. Because this way, I can get all that good onion flavor in there, too. <clears throat> well, I'm going to actually toss that. So, that's nice and hot. I'm getting my water boiling for my pasta. <clears throat> and here I have some cilantro. Hey, Fire. Hey, Michael. And scallions. I'm already... Like, this is a late-ass video because Joshua worked a couple hours later than he was supposed to and I started doing all the prep earlier. Then I was like, let me go ahead and wait till he gets home, you know, so I can, you know, because my man's gonna have a hot meal more than I care about anything. So, and yeah, he just messaged me coming, he, he's off now. So he worked late as hell. So he's gonna get a hot meal. Also, <clears throat> this, it's an egg in a cup. I did an egg. I boiled the egg. As soon as it came to a good boil, I set the timer for like five, like five minutes. Did I cook it enough? I didn't cook it enough, did I? Oh shit. We'll see. Maybe. Uh-oh, uh-oh, I did, hell yeah. Okay. Peeling this egg. Yes, not a whole lot of fun to watch. But yeah, it's like five, six minutes, depending on progress. I still want a little bit of a runny yolk. I'm going to slice it, put it in my bowl. Joshua doesn't care for egg in his ramen. I'm going to try it in mine. See if I like it. 
I think I've had it. I'm not sure. Like, I've had some uh, Tonkatsu ramen <clears throat> the, with the pork bones broth and blah, blah, blah. Did not care for it at all. I've had it, I think, three times from a couple of different places. So, it's got to be me at this point. Everyone's like, oh, it's so good. Blah, 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 blah. Like, Joshua loves it. Uh, we went out to this ramen place a couple years ago downtown that I've heard nothing but good things about. And, yeah, just, I didn't like it. Tried it another place, didn't like it. Tried it another place, didn't like it. So, it's me. And that's fine. You don't have to like everything. You like what you like. So, I shot that I healed that so bad. That was an asshole of an egg. <clears throat> Let that egg sit there until I chop it up for the um, pasta for the ramen. <clears throat> So I'm going to mix the onions through the pasta once it's cooked. Then I'm going to put the um, scallions through it and the cilantro on top. So I just want to do it like a little bit fancier kind of thing just because, you know, I'm a... Mm -hmm. yeah. And of course, you don't have to do any of these modifications. Uh, you can just eat this throughout the pack, like raw. You can chew the noodles, drink some boiling water, snort the powder, and shove the veggies up your ass. I mean, you do you. I'm going to judge you and block you from my life because you're a fucking psychopath. But, yeah. Gourmet spicy. Last time, the first time they had a good spice level to it. Second time they did not. So I have to adjust that this time as well. So I'm going to try it before I serve it. Then probably hit it with a little bit of um, like sriracha or something. Just add a little bit more heat. Because I want to stay as authentic and like Asianic as possible. And the steady turn this chicken. <clears throat> it's getting some good color on it. The chicken's almost done. My water is a boiling. I'm going to break it up because I'm not using that much water. And I want it to be that creaminess that I'm going to get from the pasta itself. Pasta is made of flour, starchy. Starch makes them creamy. So. Here's all of our flavor packets. Gonna add all those in just a minute. So fucking good. The caramelization bits from the onion are coming on the chicken, so this is giving me like a nice blackened bit on the chicken. Okay. And I'm trying to basically be adding more water to this, so I'm going to be fiddling with it a good bit, making sure everything gets nice and wet. And that's my husband's car. I'm pretty sure. Okay. Take that off the key. Put you down. Okay, yeah, this should actually work. This is about a cup and a half of water. 
Honestly, can I turn you off? Nope. You're off now. Can I turn the other one off? Okay, good. You still want one. Actually, I'll just pull you here. Let's get this chicken on a little plate. Let it rest a couple minutes before I slice it up. I want to slice it up and put it in here. Oh my god, it looks so cool. Oh, look at that. Oh, it looks so fucking good. Okay. Are there any comments or anything? I can't see dick. Just heads up. Okay, I'm going to use my chicken thing on my pasta. This is boiling ass water. It's not going to affect it. Like... I'm not remotely concerned with any kind of cross contamination with boiling ass water. Because so. anything that could be in there, trust me, it's dead. It died in about four seconds. If that. One. Now, if you add the correct amount of water, you do not have to do any of these little extra steps that I'm doing. I just kind of like the concept of pulling it off the heat. But since I limited the amount of water, I want to make sure that I don't lose it all to evaporation. That's all four. Get in here. Stir, 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 stir. Mix, mix, mix. That was it. Moscow. He's greeting the doge. Now he's going to greet me. Be right back. Hello, my tired baby. Get me your biggest, iciest cup of tea. Biggest, iciest cup of tea? Yeah, but not so much ice. <clears throat> gotcha. So just a big cup of tea. What's some ice? Like three pieces of ice. I'm closing that door, sir. That's fine. Mesquite and whatnot. This has cooked out pretty much all the water at this point. Give it a try to see if the noodles are done. Because <clears throat> using this little amount of water, we can always add more if we want to <clears throat> or if we need to. But again, like you get a certain kind of starchy when you mix, like when you let the pasta water condense like that. So, another minute. <clears throat> a little splash. Noodles aren't quite where I want them. They're a little bit hotter than I would like them personally. So, a little splash of water, no big deal. But the, the flavor is on point. I like the heat. Again, this small amount of liquid, keep stirring it, otherwise the stuff in the bottom is going to cook and the stuff on the top is not. So. That water went out literally that fast. There we go. That's where I want it. Really good back at the throat, too. Onions, I mix in here. Scallions, right in there. So we got the clean, we got the clean bite of the scallions and the smoking and the smokiness of the regular onions. So mix, mix, mix. You yeah, see. Like, if I could show y'all in the pan right now, it actually is a really, the sauce is really creamy. Alright. I'm going to get this a little bit of butter. Oh, 
tablespoon and a half. Ugh. Just to make it even creamier. Take these. I make it. <laughs> Instead of maggot. Oh, like four minutes of that. I'm cutting the chicken now. The cumulative juices go into the pot because we're not wasteful. You want strips or cubed? Cubed. Okay. Chicken's gonna taste good no matter what. It's just more of a preference thing. And cubes are easier to eat when you have like pasta. So I did the chicken like I did the bon media the night. So Let's try the chicken real quick. Mmm. All right, yummy. Mmm. Mm -hmm. mm. Butter still not melting all the way. This is weird. But whatever. Okay. Du, 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 du. <clears throat> it's not breaking because the noodles are too long. So I'm just using my spatula to press the noodles against the side of the Pot which cuts them. Here we go. A little more in this one. And we're good. Going to the chicken in there. Chicken in there. how much of an asshole this egg is going to be. That actually works. Right there. Right there. I'll go for seven minutes next time. <clears throat> Instead of six. Put in the final bit. Just some cilantro on the top so yeah shin ramen all fancy fied so, so. we're gonna go eat and i'll talk to y'all later bye